Hello, welcome back or welcome to uh, my channel, Roulette Profit and Stop. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you're watching for the first time. Thanks for tuning in. And if you like the content, give it a thumbs up. I'd greatly appreciate it if you can do that. That'd be great. Uh, my, ch my subscription rate is growing daily, which is phenomenal. Always amazing to see. And thanks very much for everybody's support. I'm a regular punter, uh, like most of my viewers are, I would, I would say. Regular punter, I, li I like to gamble. I'm not affiliated to any online casinos whatsoever. So I don't want you to join up to a casino especially so I can benefit from that. I'm not about that side of it. Although I do benefit if you take the option out to use my roulette tools. So the roulette tools you pay for to use and that's where I benefit. Um, but I'm not affiliated to any online casinos. I don't want you to join up to another casino, especially just to do what I'm doing. Um, if you are a avid gambler or you've gambled for a long time, let's say you're a social gambler or a, uh, you know, if you gamble for quite a while, then the tools might be of use to you. You might be able to spot something in the way that they work that might uh, trigger your interest to perhaps taking the option out to use one of the tools for 30 days, 60 days or 90 days access. Um, so make sure you check out my website. So my website, uh, but before we start actually, I'm gonna be using on this setup, this tool, which is the hot cold roulette tool. So the hot cold roulette tool, as the name suggests, I'm gonna be betting on either the hot number or the cold number based on the uh, criteria within the tool itself. And we're going to give it a maximum of 20 spins on the same set of numbers to try and get one hit that gets me into profit. That's the idea. So we're going to give that a go on this recording. Um, my website looks like this. So roulette profit, my precision roulette tools. Um, that's me. Um, so, yeah, for professional gamblers. So you don't have to be a professional, but if you've gambled for a long time, you know, you can maybe make use of the tools. There's a roulette tool comparison chart. I'm going to be playing the hot cold. So I'm going to click on hot cold. It'll take me straight to where that is. So hot cold is here. Um, if you wanted to use it, it'll cost you, well, £12.50 for 30 days access or £25 for 60 days or £35 for 90 days. Um, you get a slight bit of discount on the 90 days if you take it out for that long. But, um, yeah, keep an eye out. Read that table data above just to see what you like to bet, whether it's an inside bet you like to do or the outsides or all of them, or if it's a single zero table or a double zero table you like to play because uh, those ticks will show you what what uh, is available for each. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to be using the hot and cold setup, which is this tool here. So what you would do if you wanted to purchase this tool or any tool, you click on the buy button to the side of the the value that you want to spend for the term you want to play uh, use it over. When you click the buy button, it takes you to PayPal. You pay via PayPal. I'll receive an, an email from that. And then I'll reply to that email with your passcode to use that and the validation date that you've got it available for for use um, and then all you need to do with that passcode is come back to this page click here to use this tool on that button there it boots up the tool in your browser you click to the you click on the I agree and then you just input your passcode and then away you go that's as simple as I can make it that's pretty much it so make sure you check my website out there's other um, pages on my website slots and sports bets as well make sure you check those out too right so that's the website done this is where I'm at at the minute I've got 33 pounds 97 which is all profit by the way um, and my last profit value was 1050 so I've got to make more than 10 pound 50 so that will take my balance up to 44 47 so I've got to get above £44.47 pence in order to generate profit. So we'll bring you back to this sheet and I'll update that end balance hopefully once I've achieved my target of above £10.50 profit. So let me get rid of that, wherever it is. 
There we go. Let's just bring you into the casino. There we go. So this is the tool I'm going to be using. This is the hot cold setup. So click to play. I've got to input my balance. My balance is 33.97. Well, 33.97. Submit. I'm going to be playing at the minimum chip value of 10 pence. I'm going to give it 20 spins. Now there is a progression with this. And if I play out the progression and I lose all 20 spins, my risk here, my total cost or my risk is 10 pounds and 20 pence. Click Submit. Submit again. So we've got to set the neighbor number to one on the racetrack, first of all. So we'll do that. That's that sorted. Um, set history to lowest value. So bring up the statistics. History, lowest value. Whatever the lowest value is for your casino, whether it's 100 spins or 50 spins, whatever the lowest is, put it to that. Um, if there's two hot numbers in the last six spins, select the most recent spun hot number. So now we're looking at the hot number list and the last six entries. So one, two, we'll wait for this ball to land. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So 11 is the sixth number. So we're going to count backwards from that to see if there's any hot numbers. 34, that's hot. 33, no. 6, no. 19, no. 23, no. So the only hot number is number 34. So now I need to wait for another number to become hot. To go with that number 34. Now it can be 34 again, and that will be the selection. Um, just two numbers that are hot, it can be the same number hot twice in the last six entries. Number 10, is that hot? Now 10's hot and 34, so 10's the most recently hitting hot number. 10 is the bet. So I'm going to do 10 with one number either side. I'm going to set the autos for close. 10. And click on number 10. 10 was the pick because there was because no 34 was hot and it's in the last six spins, and 10 was the most recently hitting hot number, so that gives me two hot numbers from the hot number list in the last six spins. So this is my first bet. It's the hot side of the hot cold game play. I'm looking for 10 with one pocket either side. And 16. That's 16. Click right. lost, click repeat on Please the tool. I've set the autos for the casino. For 10 autos. Bets closing. So don't have to worry about updating the bets on the, um, the casino just yet. But no more bets second bet. So what's going to happen on this setup is I'm either going to hit within 13 spins of the 20 that I can give it. And I'll get into profit within the 13 spins. It'll hit close to it'll it'll hit around the 13 spin or get close to hitting around the 13 spin. Or it'll hit to the left of 23. That's a loss. To the right of the five, and then within four spins, it'll hit one of my numbers. So if it gets close to 23, to the left of 23, let's say, um, by a couple of pockets, either two, one or two pockets to the side of 23. So if it hits the eight or the 30. And then it hits the other side of the 5. So if it hits the 24 or the 16, not long after, then I'll get my hit within 4 spins of that happening. Two. Number 2. Now, 2 for me is a combo for 10. So this could very well hit on this 4th bet, number 10. For me, my combo for 2 is 2, 10, 22. So repeat the 2 or the neighbour, down to 10 or the neighbour, and across the 22 in the neighbour. That's pretty much what my combo is for number 2. So this is what I'm going to be looking at and quoting throughout this setup. My combo numbers for all the numbers that land to try and get me to number 10, 23 or the 5 hitting. This is the fourth bet. And, oh, that's 27. Red. So 27. Place your bets just landed now it might be doing every other spin right so that two Bet might go to the combo number 2 10 22 after that 27 because it's doing alternating spins no more bets, please. so this could be the winning spin or the combination number for that number two because of the alternating spin factor it's going clockwise and anti-clockwise so 
Looking for number 10, 23, or 5. 12. 12. Nope. Red. No joy. Spin number 6 is coming Please up. Looking for red. 10, 23, 5. Bets. Now, I'm not going to get a lot of profit out of this. It's not going to give me £10.50 in the one single hit on a 10 pence stake covering three numbers. I'm not going to get that from this tool. I would need to hit it three times to get close to getting to that value. But I'm only going to give this one round of this. This is the sixth spin. Looking for 10. And here we go. That's one off. Brilliant. Four. That's the neighbour of five, right? This is what I want you to see. So this has gone to the side of the five, which is one away from a hit. The neighbour of 24 is five, which would have been a hit, right? So now I need it to go to the other side of 23. So we need to see numbers 8, 30, or the 11. We can, well, 8, eight or 30, ideally, because they're two pockets, one pocket and two pockets away from the 23. And if that happens, I know I'm going to get a hit within four spins. Of that happening. Oh, ten. there we go. Ten's landed. That is a win. Stop the autos. I've got my ten. Undo the bet. Click one. One pound fifty profit. Booming. There we go. There's my hit. I'm going to switch tables. I'm going to go to another automated table. I've just clicked on statistics. I got the win in seven spins. At a 10 pence stake, it gave me £1.50. I'm going to use the same tool again, but on a different table. Another automated table, same stake. Uh, this VIP one. We're going to set it up in the same way. And we're going to see if this one's going to play for me as well and pay. So, menu, click to play. Now I've got a balance of 35. 47 submit 10 pence stake submit submit again bring up the statistics make sure it's the last round is 50 or the lowest whatever the lowest is for you count the last six spins there's a spin out there at the minute uh one two three four five six so 31 that position where my pointer is is the sixth number we'll just wait for this one to land 22 Right, we're going to see how many hot numbers there are. Four is a hot number, thirty, and they're all black. They're all red after the number four, and I've only got black numbers, so four is the only hot number. So this could be the cold number side, which is perfect. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So if when this number drops in now, if this number drops in now, and it's not a hot number. And there's no hot numbers present in the last six spins. We slide the rounds up to 300 or 200 if you can't get to 300. And we pick the top coldest number as the selection. So if this number now that drops in isn't hot, isn't in the hot number list, then um, 28, it's not in the hot number list. So we slide it up to 300. Number two is the pick. So I'm going to bet on number two. I'm going to set the autos for ten. Now I'm playing the cold side of the gameplay. So no more bets, this is the cold setup. Now the cold side, I usually get a hit within 11 spins rather than the 13 spins as it is for the hot. This is the cold side. So this is now probably going to hit within 11 spins of placing the bet. If I'm lucky. And again, it can work the same way where it'll hit the neighbor number of 21, the neighbor number of 25, and hit the numbers in the middle within four spins. This is my first bet. Number two. 29. 29. So click lost. Click repeat. I've already set the autos for 10 spins for now. There is a progression. The progression is 10 pence per number, 20 pence per number, and 30 pence per number. 10 pence per number for the first 10 spins. 20 pence per number for the next six spins and 30 pence oh, per number for the final four spins. This is my second bet for number 221.25, the coldest number within 300 spins.
So 21, 2, 25, let's go. Second bet. Usually this one hits sooner. 36 is good. 36 is good because it's close to number 4. 36 likes to go to number 4, 19. And I've got the 21, 2 and 25, which are all close to that range of numbers. 21 is my closest number to the 4. And the 19. So it could hit 21 on this spin with a little bit of luck. This is my third bet. No more bets, please. If this hits, I'll switch to another auto table and do another round of this. This is the hot cold roulette tool. Check it out from my website. Um, the website address will be linked in the description below. Make sure you hit subscribe. Give it a thumbs up if you like the content. Looking for number two. Spin number three for number two. And, oh, that thought about it. Five. That Red. thought about it for a split second, then Please shot right round to five. Bets. Again, this is an alternating spin direction table, so it could do every other spin with my combination numbers that I'm quoting. No more bets, so 36 could, could go to number 4 neighbor from this position now, from this spin, because if it's doing every other spin, 36 was its last, it might go to number 4 or the neighbor of 4 with a bit of luck. This is spin number 4, looking for the coldest number. The 300 spins, which is number two, and I've got the neighbor number of that two as well. Boom, there you go. 25 is a win. 25. I have just made red. two pounds 40 profit on that one. Please That's the coldest bets. number set up. The coldest number usually hits faster than the hottest one, which is really weird. But I've just made 390. I'm looking to get to 1050. I'm going to change tables again, and we're going to play another auto table. Um, we're gonna go. We're gonna go again, basically. Uh, I don't want to play the speed. I want to play this one. We'll try this one. May as well. Get my video set into HD. No. Try. So menu. Click to play. So actually, it took me four spins on that. It took me seven spins for the hot. Four spins for the cold. Now I've got a balance of thirty-seven. 87, submit that, 10 pence stake, submit, submit. Again, we bring up the statistics, slide it down to the minimum. Look at the hot numbers list, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So is 7 hot? Yes, it is. 34? No. Nope. And they're all, there's only one black number, number 6. So 7. So this could be a cold number setup as well, because there's only one number, which is hot, which is number 7. And, then, and that's in the 6th position. So that's going to go out of the sixth position once this next number lands. So if this next number is not hot, I'm going to slide it up to 300 rounds. So if this isn't hot, 34, it is hot. So we've got 34 and it's hit twice. So that's the selection. There we go. 34 is the selection because that's hit twice. Um. Here we go. So this is the hot side of the gameplay. No more bets. 34, if we count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. 34 is hot there. It was there, and it's here. So it's been in twice in the last six rounds. So this is this is why that's a selection. So looking for 34, 17, and 6. Oh, that was on its way. Red. So I've got the auto set Please for 10 again. Hopefully we'll get a win on this one pretty soon on. And then uh, Bets I'll switch closed. tables. No more bets, please. See what we can play next. So we're looking for numbers 34, 17 or 6. Oh. 13. 13, right. right. That's getting closer. Please Two pockets away, that is. That's really good. So six is my closest number, and that was two pockets away from the six. Now, if it's two pockets away from the 17 on this spin, or the next, or within a few spins, I'll get a win 
within four spins of that happening. No more bets, please. So the amount of times this has happened is ridiculous, right? So if it's like, let's say it's number 25 or number 2 that lands now, or in a few spins. Oh, it's repeated. Oh, <laughs> this is going to hit, right? I'm going to get a hit on the 17, 34, or 6. Absolutely. 100%. Bets closing. So I'm going to see how long it takes to hit. It's hovering around that region, you see. That's what I'm seeing. I'm seeing it quite often. It's hovering around that region. 34 is going to hit for a third time. Or it's going to hit the 16, the 17 or the 6. It's going to hit one of my numbers any minute. Brilliant. That's a loss. 28. Spin at number 5 coming up. Please so on this hot bets. side of it, I'll usually hit within 13 spins or get close to hitting within 13 spins. Or it'll hit close, which it's already been two pockets away from a hit twice on the close. six. We want it to go to the other side of 17, and then within four spins, you want to get the hit. No more bets, please. Or hit any time now. It would be perfect. I've played three auto tables. This is my third one now, using this tool. Oh, uh, yep. Lost, Black. like a repeat. So, Please place your bets. that was a bit erratic the way the ball moved and shot over there. So that's not going to go there again. It's going to go opposite, a quarter distance up or down. So it's going to be 15, 20, close. or close to hitting on this spin. No 15, 20, or oh, sorry, 15, 16, or close to hitting on this spin. A hit would be nice. But 15, 16, I think, or close to hitting. 15, there you go. 15. I tell you. Please place your bets. I know how these autos work, I really do. I make a lot of money on these tables. Oh my God. When, when the tables bets. are doing what I'm expecting them to do, and this is shown exactly. <laughs> this might, no this might hit 15 again or go, go to 24. Now, if it doesn't go to 15 neighbor or down to 24, this is going to be a win. So 17, 34, and 6. This is the seventh bet. 26. Oh, it's 26. Black. It's close to 15. It's a few Please pockets out. Your bets. I would have been one out there because I would have done two pockets either side of the 15. I would have covered the zero, but not the 26 on my bet. So now it's gone to zero. Bets. Zero might go to 17 with a bit of luck. 17 would be good. We don't want to see 27 or 13. No bets, please. It might hit the 13 because that's hit twice in a, in a row. So it could give us a third timer for that. I was hoping, hopeful for the third timer for the uh, 34, to be fair. But it might give me the 13. Oh, hello. It's 27. That's one off again, look. So please I'm right. I'm one away from a hit on that six. So within four spins now, I would expect to win. It's been... 13 twice and now 17 once so it's getting closer so this this should be a win within four spins and i'll be doubling up at the on the 11th bet so we've got one more bet at 10 pence before i double up and it's best time to double up is on the 11th best time to win is on the 11th bet which is a double up so this this is going to hit within four spins this is the first spin at spin of four 29 black please place your bets so this is the um, tenth spin. The next spin, I'll be doubling up on it. So this is my second bet. From a guesstimation of getting a win within four spins of being one away from hitting that number six. No more Normally I would wait for a close to one side and close to the other, but it's been close too many times to one side. So that that will verify that as as the bet. Second bet. Here we go. Beautiful. Eight now I'm going to double up. Red. The tool is telling me to double up. So, place your bets. double up. Click repeat. Away we go. Spin 11 at times 2 now. 60 pence total, bets. 20 pence per number. This is the best time to hit. And this will be my third bet of my expected win because it was one off that no 6 bets, please. Um, a few three spins ago when it, when it hit 27. So this is my third bet. 
I've got one more bet where I think I'm going to get a hit. It's either going to hit on this spin or the next. Not this one. Seven. Red. So seven likes to go Please to 13 or the neighbor of 13. Now, hopefully it's going to be the six. So this is now the fourth bet, my expected winning spin. Bets closing. Based on what's happened already. Now, if it doesn't hit, no it doesn't matter. Here. We can just carry on, keep playing, see what happens. My risk is ten pounds twenty, no matter what. Anyway, so we're looking for thirty-four, seventeen, and six. See that? It was all over it. It went backwards. Went to eleven. Naughty, naughty. So please place your bets. I'm convinced I'm going to get my hit. I'm on my thirteenth spin. So it's usually on the hot number gameplay, which is what I'm playing now, I'll get close to hitting now or hit around the 13th spin. No more bets, please. And this is the 13th spin. So let's see if this does it. Come on, number six. Nope, back to seven. Seven. Red. 14th bet. I'm Please only going to give it 20. My risk is my risk here is £10.20. I could stop at any point. If I don't feel like I'm going to get my hit, Bets. I could just say, right, I'm not playing. I'm going to stop and maybe change tables. So I could take a £5.40 no, loss please. at this point if this loses. You know, there's, there's always, you can always have an exit strategy of your own, whatever you want to do. So looking for 34, 17, and 6. Right, this could be good. Red. This could be the one. Please 23. Now, 23 for me would be either, would be either 23, 32, 3, Bets. or back to 23. Or maybe number 18 or 17. So I've got a lot of numbers for 23 that could land. So 17 would be the bet here hit for me this is the 15th spin we're looking for 17 34 6 oh one off again one off again Red. one away from six Please 27 place your bets. Ugh, really annoying so i'll be increasing again very very soon if this one misses i've got three times the chip value bets per number that's close. 30 pence per number so all i need to do is um click on 34. No more bets, please. And then we'll just keep playing until I hit. Well, for 20 spins. This is the 16th spin. Ideally, I'd like to see the neighbor of 27 land. Not number 13. Eight. No. Black. Right, three times. Please place your bets. There you go. Now it's 30, 90 pence bet. 90 pence bet. 17 spins in. I'm going to give it 20 spins maximum. Bets closing. No more bets, please. So, 17 spins in. Am I going to hit 34, 6 or 17? It's been one off hitting 6 twice and two away from hitting 6 twice. Thirty-five. 35. 18 spins. Please place your I have 20. So, this could cost me £10.50, but £10.20, but that's okay. Bets. This is my risk. This is my risk, you see. £10.20 is my risk. No more bets, I'm please. comfortable losing that. I'm comfortable with that. So, 17, 34 and 6. Although, it, it would be nice to see a win. That would be fantastic. Seven again. Seven. Well, that's that seven, doesn't Red. it? Come on, seven. Please seven. I'll just close out of that. It's already The bet's already there. 7 went to 11, 7 went to 23. Let's see where this 7 goes. Bets closing. 6, hopefully. No more bets, Number please. 6. 6, 34, 17 for the win. I'm on the 19th bet of 20. Taking it right to the end.
Nope. Never seven. Twenty-eight. Final bet. Black. This is it. I've got to Eight. manually press Eight. repeat. There you go. So this is the final bet. Ten pounds twenty. If I lost, if I lose, I've lost ten pounds twenty. But it was worth the bet. Every bet a place is worth it. Whether I win or lose, bit of entertainment. Bets. Close. Not guaranteed to win, as you can see. I have to say that because it is gambling. Bets, please. I don't expect to win all the time, but I do pretty well most of the time. Now, I could give this a five spin extension, but it's not really been anywhere close apart from that 27 and 13. It's not gone to the other side of 17. Oh, there you go. Boom, got my hit. Fantastic. There's my win on my 20th spin. Boom, there you go. 60 pence. Yay! But you know what? I'm more than I'm over the moon with that because it's Bet's given me, closing. it's played it out right to the death. The death, the final spin win, <laughs> number seventeen landed. I didn't think it was going to hit because it hadn't been to the left of seventeen. I was a bit. Uh, that was a red flag, which is what I would have should have said really earlier on. You need the ball to go to the right of the number and to the left of your numbers, then you know it's going to go in between. One but um, that's £4.50 profit. Now I'm going to put that one to bed, that tool, which is the uh, hot cold number tool. And we're going to switch over to the single number setup. We're going to play a different table. And I need to make £6, well, six, anything above £6, and that's me done, basically. So we're going to go back over to this auto again. Anything above £6, and we're good. So single zero table. Uh, we're going to play, in fact, no, we're not. We'll go to American Wheel because we can do an American table. So let's see if we can jump on an American Wheel somewhere, wherever it is. There it is. Because this is a 20 pen stake table, and if this hits, I've got my target. My target is to get to 44.47, greater than 44.47. That's the target. So double zero. We're going to input the numbers from the history. We've got 6, 16. And it's just crossing these off with yellow dots on the number on the wheel. Once I've got four in a row, I'm going to go do neighbours of seven either side. I think that's 26, isn't it? Uh, 26, 25, 11, 30, 15, uh, 15 17, 23, 20. Right, I'm looking for four yellow dots in a row. We've got three here, and with a, a missing number seven. I'm going to increase this to seven neighbor, like that. The neighbor number to seven. And I'm going to input these numbers at that land. So if, if it hits number nine, or the seven, if it hits the seven, I'll be doing 11 neighbors by seven. If it hits the nine, I can choose between the 30 and the 26. So, everything else has just got, oh, the four, if the four lands are the 14, I can pick numbers between that range. So I've got a few, it's hitting single zero range, that's where it's going towards at the minute. And this is a, this will be a 20 pence stake bet, and if I hit on my first spin, this is going to get me to my target. I'm going to be over £44.47. Uh, which will be a stop. So I've successfully demonstrated the hot cold roulette tool. Now I'm on, now I'm using the single number setup, which is free to use, by the way. This one, this tool's free. We've got three dots in a row there. So if it hits 32, I can pick 17 with seven either side, because that'll be one, two, three, four, five numbers in a row with the yellow dots. If it hits the 7, that'll be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I can pick the 11 with 7 either side. If it hits the 34, that'll be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I can pick the number 22 with 7 either side. If it hits the number 4, that's 1, 2, 3, 4. I can pick the 4 or the 23 to take my pick. If it hits 14, I can pick the 14 or 35 because that's 4 in a row. So I've got options. If it hits the 9, I can pick the 26 or 30. Nine. There we go. Nine. Boom. So I can pick the 26 or the 30. I'm going to go with the 30. There's four yellow dots. Where's 30? So I've got 35 through to 22 covered, right? This is my first bet. 
plus there's four yellow dots in a row. Four numbers in a row that I've hit. 9, 26, 30 and the 11. I've chosen 30 as my selection with 7 either side of it. 15 numbers total. 22 to 35 I've got covered. 22 all the way to 35. This range where it's hitting the most pretty much. 22, 35. First bet. And that's number 18, which is a miss. So I'm going to repeat the same bet, same stake. So there is a progression on this. So this is not going to get me to my target on this spin. I have to hit twice now, I think. I think I've got to hit twice on this. So I'm still on the 22 all the way to the 35. Because we've got four yellow dots in a row. So it's going to come back to this range of numbers, hopefully. 30 was the selection with seven either side. I've just repeated the same bet. The next bet, I'll be increasing it. I'll be doubling it up. Thirty-five. That's one off. That's a little bit of a piss take, if you ask me. That although it has ha that number has been out already before. So this is a repeat and add a chip. So effectively, a double up now. So we want that 23 to come inside of the 23 to hit towards the 14, the 2, the 0, the 28, the 9, that range. So if, it's any, if it hits that, it wants it to bounce this direction to the left of 23. This is now my third bet. And if this misses, I'll add another chip. Repeat the bet and add another chip per number. 22 to 35. There you go, there's my hit, 32, that's there, so that's a win, that gets me to £40.87, 32, bosh, now I've got a new set of numbers here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so I can do 17, so we'll do that, because that's just landed, it's filled in another yellow dot, and that gives me four, a, a minimum of 4 in a row, that's 5, so I've got 17 covered, so I've got 9 through to 36. Now, if this one hits, that'll be my target achieved. So 9 all the way through to 36. 9, 36. Anywhere near 17 is good. Bit of lag. 16's a miss. So repeat the bet. Same stake. And the next bet will be a double up. So I'm on 17 with 7 out of the side. 36 all the way through to 9. So left of double zero, or right of the single zero, anywhere near 17 is good. They didn't spin it from the correct position as a croupier. Professional trained croupiers do not spin it from where he spun it from. They spun it from the last number out, and that wasn't the last number out. Anyways, 17 is the bet. This is why I know... This is why I know the table and the wheel are in control and not the dealer. Thank you very much. Just so you know. <laughs> Repeat the bet. Add a chip on the 17. So every time I lose from this position, I'm repeating and adding a chip. This should give me... Um, the profit I need, I think, just over. So 9 through to 36, so 9 all the way through to 36, 9, 36, 17 was the bet. Ta-da! 34 is a hit. Boom. Click 34. £43. I'm nearly there. Now it's filled in another dot. So we can go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 is the bet now. The centre number of the range that's hit him. So 5 is the bet, which is 26 to 13, is it? Yeah, 26 to 13. 
it's one over from the 17 basically so 26 through to 13 five is the bet let's see if this hits straight away if this hits straight away i've got my target that'll be a stop anywhere near five that'll do that's a hit 13 six that is a win and that is my target i've got 47 47 fan bloody tastic i used the single number setup on the double zero table most happy about that so i'm going to bring up the sheet and put in 47 47 as my ending balance so that's just giving me 1350 profit look at this i'm getting profit after profit after profit increasing every time so that's another setup done which is fantastic buzzing here so yeah 37.40 total so far it's all profit this anyway what you see this 47 47 is all profit because i started with a 10 pound deposit and i wanted to, to secure that first so i made 15 pounds profit so i withdrew 10 and i left in 15 and that's giving me my first target of 5.30 and then I took it from 5.30 to 8.10, 8.10 to 10.50, 10.50 to 13.50 and then the next setup when I come back will be 13.50 um, to whatever it goes to. So yeah, thanks for tuning in. I'll be back later to do another recording. Don't forget to hit subscribe, give it a thumbs up, show your support and um, see you again soon.